Well, the mayor and chief of police are expected to show their support and solidarity to North York Jewish Girls School this morning after it was hit by gunfire over the weekend. A CP 24s Courtney Hills is live at the school, which is near Dufferin and Finch, and joins us live with more on what we can expect later this morning. Courtney. Good morning, Nick and Jennifer. And this is a solidarity rally, a rally to show support for the school community and, of course, the Jewish community, given the investigation that is unfolding in this area. Gunfire toward an all-girls Jewish elementary school behind me here. I can tell you this morning uh, there are uh, several police officers set up just outside of the school. They've got heavy security, heavy police presence in this area ahead of the gathering. And as you mentioned, the mayor, Olivia Chow, along with Toronto's police chief, Myron Demke, will be here. So we're hoping to get a chance to speak with the chief, especially get an update on where they are in this investigation. We know that emergency crews were called to this elementary school over the weekend. It was about five in the morning. At that time, the call came in for reports of shots fired toward the school. What we heard from police, they say they found evidence of gunfire. No injuries, thank goodness. Nobody was inside the school at the time of this shooting. And police were asked at this time whether this was considered a hate crime, given much of the evidence they were looking at at the time. They said it was just too early. So we're hoping to get an update from the police on where they stand in this investigation, perhaps if they have any descriptions when it comes to a suspect or suspects responsible for firing uh, an, a weapon toward this elementary school behind me here. So as I mentioned, guys, just in the last, I'd say, half an hour or so, we've noticed a, a bit of a pickup in the uh, the energy and the number of people just outside of the school where we are. This is as close as we can get. You can see it's gated off. Uh, when we arrived here first thing this morning, there was only one cruiser. And police had said over the weekend they were going to increase their presence, not only outside of the school, but in this neighborhood as a result of the investigation and the shooting toward the school. So uh, that has certainly been the case. As they say, we're seeing uh, several officers outside of the school, and there is going to be this rally. We understand the rabbi at the school will also be speaking ahead of uh, the school officially opening for the day. So certainly more to come. But this comes at a time when so many people with the school community and the Jewish community are, are very upset and concerned over what happened. Over to you. Okay, absolutely. So that gets underway mm -hmm. in about an hour's time. That is CB24's Courtney yeah. Hills live for us this morning. Court, thank you.